Hi guys, it's Tasha. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the crib. For my returning positive supporters and subscribers, welcome back. Come on in and get comfortable. Guys, I got a few things from AliExpress and I got something from Etsy. And I'm going to go with the AliExpress stuff first. I got... Where did bows at? I, I ordered two of these. And I had seen these like a year ago. And I ordered it. And it never showed up. So I had to uh, file the claim, you know, that it didn't show up. So I got my money back. So this time I saw them. I said, let me try it again. So let me order two. Maybe if I have maybe a little bit more in the envelope that that'll show up. And this came the last day that I could file a dispute to say that it didn't show up. So they finally showed up. And I'm happy I got these two. This is my little lemon head guy right here for my recipe cards. This is my little my little pear head. I call him apple hip. This is my little pear head guy right here or person could be a girl. Oh, it's a girl because there's the bow. My little my little pear head lady here she is right here. A little lemon head my little lemon head male and my little pear head girl female. And I got this this um, knife, fork, and spoon die, and I received this little bear with the heart in uh, as a free gift. So those are my AliExpress dies, and this is the stuff I got from Etsy. And these are some stamps. I saw Miss Leela from Crafts and Halls, Halls with Leela, and I said, okay, those stamps are going to be so cute. Let me try to get some for my junk journaling. And then when I got this, I saw these across the front. I'm like, oh my God, those are so gorgeous. So I'm actually going to cut these out somehow. If you guys know the best way to get, me, ooh, there we go. If you guys know the best way to get these off without damaging them, let me know and uh, I will get these off. And I, I'll probably end up going to YouTube and like how to remove stamps from an envelope or something. So I can get these off and use them in my junk journal. But... Here are the stamps that I got. And I can't even remember how many is in here. And uh, come on off. There we go. I really can't remember. I don't know if it's 50 or 100. And I don't think that they were expensive. But don't hold me too much. Because I just don't remember to be totally honest. Ooh, this tearing. I don't want to tear it. Okay, there we go. That's better. Uh, so, I'm not going to go over all of them, but I, I can show you these. And these have postmarks on them as well. Now, how do, how do people get a hold of this stuff? How, just how do you get a hold of it? And these are from overseas, because that's one from Australia. Where is this one from? I can Oh Lord, this is this says nine pence. Okay, that's Aust okay. I guess these are all Australian. If they not, they, it doesn't matter. I don't even care. Yeah, these these seems to be all from Australia, but I think they are so cute. Okay, those are Australia. Let me put these back because I don't want to get them mixed up just in case they're different. But I guess it really wouldn't matter, huh? Just pick out what I like and keep it moving. And put these back in here. And let's open up the second pack here. Try to be careful and not tear it. And I tore it anyway. Oh my gosh, this. Okay. Okay. Now, see these in my hand? It's not all of us, one or two left in there. And these, oh, these are Australia as well. So that's cool. There we go. Just a bunch of really pretty stamps, different colors all vintage looking they are vintage 
Man, I got these again to go in my junk journal. Ooh, I think those are going to be real cute too. Okay, guys, that is it for my little haul right now. I want to thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to watch my video. If you haven't, I would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. All your comments, I truly appreciate it. Come back anytime, and i see you all in my next video. And remember, guys, still rude eyes, still rude. Bye-bye, love bugs.